What's up, everybody? 2018 Bowman Hobby Full Case Random Divisions number seven. No, I think you got you had a you had an additional giveaway. I think I did something with those as well. Yeah, it was three times. Next thing you know, I'm gonna be giving away a house or something. I don't know. That, wow, how crazy would that be, man? Give away a house. Two and three. We got Mr. Frank Quelly up top, Sean down. Guys, so I happen to dust off this case here. And I looked at the checklist, and I'm like, my goodness. 2018 Bowman is, I mean, it's pretty stacked. And three. And a west up, AL Central down. Stack saw. Nasty, nastyhouses.com. <laughs> Douglas. Let me remove the contents from this, and I will mail you this box. Mystery box, all yours, my friend. <laughs> Guys, Revolutionary War in the store. You can win your very own personal case of 2017 Flawless Collegiate Football. Chance at my homies, Trubisky and such. I'm giving away two spots in that break in each one of the Prism 5 boxers in the store. If anybody wants to grab teams in that, those are getting pretty close to full sauce. If you want to just buy a full outright spot, I would not be mad at you. Um, you get to keep your box, too. What's up, Aces? Lions win, indeed. Lions win. Man, the old phalanges are ice. Straight ice. How sick is this going to be if we pull some sort of just massive super fracture auto? What's up, Kevin? What's up, Boots? What's up, Pac-Man? What's up, Solly? What's up, Scott? What's up, Evan? Code 45, two zigzags, baby. They also, guys. I have that 2015 Tops Bowl in the store at $27.99, guaranteed hit. The cheapest I have ever ran it. Well, I ain't trying to freeze the, uh, the satchel there, uh, the Shadow. I'm getting in such a baseball vibe. I watched the rookie over the weekend. It was, it was it was it was nice. Dana took the girls over to her mom's. I had to split wood, load the basement with wood. I was freaking exhausted afterwards. Fired up the old tube, and the rookie was on. That is such a good movie. Your line eye, your line eye are in all kinds of college breaks. All kinds of college breaks. Who's the greatest Illini football player ever, Parrish? Jeff George? Stop it. You're just being modest. Good old red was in the line eye, huh? Okay. <laughs> Big Seth, I am fresh out, bro. Ham. Holy smoke, that's a red refractor. Is that got an ink? I can't remember if these are upside down or not. Are you, are you kidding me? That is a massive card. At least it used to be. I think it still is. Holy shite. DJ Peters, Red Refractor Auto. Straight up marination. Wow. Oh, my Lord. 
That just happened. Oh my God. Douglas, if you'd have woke up today and somebody said they're going to throw a big Peter at you, you'd have been like, listen here, asshole. But I think you, uh, I think you willingly accept this one. Uh, you know, Seth, I have not even, uh, inquired, uh, in terms of, uh, what it's at. I truly don't even know what it is. I had, uh, I think 28 cases. We bumped through it and just haven't, uh, rocked the cradle back. <laughs> nice. DJ Peters is one of their top prospects, isn't it? All right, Parrish. I feel like you're just straight up hitting Google at this point. Right, Joel? 365 days a year, I do. You know what I'm saying? All right. Can somebody look and see what, like, a DJ Peters gold auto sells for? I'm curious as to how big that Peters is. I know it's not Fung. But is it, like, Ron Jeremy? It's above average. <laughs> that is so insane, man. That card looks phenomenal, Douglas. Uh, what plates and patches, Jake? You're talking about the eBay breaks? You're talking about the eBay breaks. Those were uh, Saturday morning. If you're talking about the plates and patches in the store, uh, that's probably coming up next. That's a red shimmer, though, Scott. Oh, yeah, that's uh, Jake. That still has a few teams left. I'm going to run a filler for that next. Gold sold for 284. Is that what you're firing at me, Parrish? That's probably like a um, that's probably like an eight hundred to a thousand dollar Peters there then. Maybe maybe even a smidge more. I, I'm I'm out of tune right now. Guys, lock up your spots in the Prism 5 Box Bangers. I'm giving away two Revolutionary War spots in each one of those breaks. Grab your spots in the uh, Prism 5 Box Bangers for that tasty, sweet, sweet nectar. Or grab your spot in the Full Cases Break yourself. You get to keep your box. And if you think about it, you know, there's two Galactics floating around in there. And there's possible Luca parallels and such. There's a lot of boxes that can definitely yield more than $120 in value. 
Plus, you get the chance at winning a freaking 2017 Flawless Collegiate Football case. That is two briefcases. Two. Asking 35 Hundy. Nice. I mean, there's asking and there's selling, but that's delightful. I mean, realistically, Douglas is probably going to give that to me for like a Fernando Martinez gold refractor auto out of like, uh, what was Fernando? 20, 20, uh, 2011 Bowman Chrome or something. Sick Fernando Martinez, huh? Huh? Maybe a Kevin Seitzer 88 Tops rookie. In PSA 10 form, of course. <laughs> yeah, probably. <laughs> oh, Douglas is so nice. He says, yeah, probably. Laugh out loud in the chat. But at, at his home, home right now, I think you're curious, like, shut the hell up, Bates. Whoa, no 45, two zigzags, and baby, that's what you need. We got, a, we got a straggler here. Nasty Kevin Seitzer. I'll tell you what, Douglas. I'll even throw in a Jerry Kuzman second-year tops card. 69 Tops Kuzman. Hell yeah, Chris. Thank you, sir. That Revolutionary War is going to be fun. I'm going to throw a few Revolutionary War spots into the fillers as well. For the Prism. For multiple chance at Revolutionary Wars. Damn it, Douglas. You drive a hard bargain. I'll just send you the feeders. All right, fellas. Good luck to y'all. We obviously know that Douglas has already uh, absolutely murdered death killed this break. So uh, good luck, everybody, including you, Douglas, for the rest of the break. All right. The Bone Man again. Chris, uh, did you uh, did you sell your bank show? How'd that go, man? Did you get a price that uh, you were happy with? Five twenty-two, not bad. Not bad. Hoskins the one fifty. Blue paper. Phillies. Oh fellas, so I got my MRI results back. Adrian Moore John. Purple. And I have a herniated disc. And it is currently uh, hitting uh, my nerves, which is why I have uh, pain and tingling in my right three uh, phalanges on my right foot. So that's pretty neat. So we got some nice injections and uh, Garcia to 125 and uh, physical therapy for six weeks coming up. Pretty excited for that. Vlad Guerrero Jr. Hell yeah, Chris. Happy birthday to Faith. Speaking of that, it's my brother's birthday in a few days. Domingo Acevedo. Dude, Cece is a little freaking hustler. So today, um, before I left, 
we're just uh, laying down on the couch watching one of her movies. Uh, myself, uh, Dana, and her, and she kept trying to get her mom off the couch so that her and I could just cuddle and watch the movie before I left. That's what that's what she wanted. Oh, her mom was was being stubborn and, and would not get up. So we're laying there, and I said that I'm gonna tickle her mom, and just bear with me on the story. And so her mom says. You got to tickle Cece then too. So Cece sits there for a second. Probably about two or three minutes pass. We drop it. She finishes watching the scene that she wanted. She gets up, walks away from the couch, turns around and goes, Okay, Daddy, tickle Mommy now. <laughs> Cole Reagans. She's a little savage. Freaking love it. For the Rangers. Jimenez, what's the uh, word on that cat there, Douglas? Is he going to be uh, a beast? Junior Fernandez Atomic. Oh, very, she, dude, way, way too smart for her own good. So all, Lothar. Butterfield, Butterfield, Butterfield. Butterfield, I'll answer that question as soon as I take this hood off. Because I made it too hot in here now. Butterfield, that word, or that, that can be answered with one word. Too many options. I combined all those words into one. Austin Voth. Corbin Burns. And NT Basketball is the... Garrett Cooper Gold is the overwhelming favorite and accepted high-end RPA that there is. If they would come out and they would make three sets, they would have RPAs in them and number none of them higher than, say, 399. The amount of value in all three would be off the charts. But when there are 37 different options of an RPA, the dollars get spread thin. Thus, sustainability is not there for super high dollar amounts. Now, if the player is an absolute beast, Adrian Morjohn, surely it's going to sustain a little bit of money, but it's not going to hold a candle to an NTRPA, which could be like five to seven grand. Harper. Just like anything, man, the more options you have generally drives the price down of everything because everything has to compete for the dollars. Christian Stewart to 250. That's right, class. Today in Nasty Breaks, we are going to cover the economics of sports cards. The deal with opulence. Opulence basketball is phenomenal. Opulence basketball does not have history. We can see a time where maybe something of that nature all of a sudden catches on and people uh, are all about it. And at that point, you know, that's delightful. But the problem is, ooh, sick. Jimenez refractor to 499. The problem is, is the continuing of SKUs. Certain products, uh, they'll pop out for a year or two and then they disappear. Thus giving no longevity, no ability to build a fan base 
uh, thus decreasing long-term value. Because say, uh, Michael Conforto, say little uh, Billy Joe Bob hops into the hobby six years from now, right? Knows nothing about past hobby. Somebody shows him an opulence card. Well, to him, the norm is not opulence, Alex Lang. And he uh, puts his nose up to it. He's like, no, they don't even make that set anymore. Why, why would I want that? Blah, 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 blah. That's part of the problem, too. But I agree, man. Opulence is a phenomenal card. No, impeccable. You see, here's the thing. Impeccable is delightful. You have to look at the certain certain scenarios. Impeccable is delightful because of the um, autographs uh, for specific career achievements, draft positions, and such as that. I mean, don't get me wrong. The, the RPAs aren't bad, but the insane value is in the draft picks and like the special stuff like that. Butterfield, don't tell anybody that I said this, but... I, I, I generally am not a cardboard diva when it comes to that stuff, but I actually kind of agree with you. Will Craig, I saw him and I'm like, ew, I don't know that I necessarily like that. I don't think I've ever really said that about uh, much. Adibert Alzale. But uh, keep that between you and I, Butterfield. Okay. You like me? Walker Bueller to four ninety nine. Stop it, Butterfield. You're gonna make me blush. I am very honest. What is like a drug dealer? Get you some of that cardboard crap. Shed long. Code forty five two six seven. Baby, that's what we need. Perish. Stop it. Butterfield clarified. He said, as a dealer, you just like me, Parrish. You like me. Guys, after I'm done with that second stack, I have to hit the thermostat. I'm starting to sweat. Corbin Burns for the Brew Crew. Again, guys, revolutionary war tonight. Keep your box. Winner gets a case of 2017 Collegiate Football. Flawless. You got the Mahomes. You got the Trubisky. You got Desha I can't believe I didn't say Deshaun Watson earlier. Dane Dunning. Uh, what's up, Brad? It did. Eric Stone won it. If I remember right, though, Brad, you bought into Impeccable, which means you're going to have another chance at 500 to break credit on Wednesday morning. I didn't think I was, Parrish. I picked up what you were putting down, Parrish, and that's okay. Select, that's right. Select. You bought, um, actually, I'm not even going to act like I can remember. I know I saw it earlier, but I can't remember. Colt 45, two zigzags, baby, that's up and need. Guys, limited football coming up next, and then we're going to start on those prisms, and then hopefully by the time we're done with the prisms, the uh, last Revolutionary War spots will have been purchased. Pedro Avila. Logan Allen, Padres. Uh, impeccable Checklist actually came out a while ago. Like last week, I believe. Does look delightful. 
I'm pretty excited to break Impeccable. I really am. I'm excited to break Select Football, though, too. Duki Toussaint. And Lakers contends. Huh? Jordan Humphreys. Really what? Yeah, check this out last week. If that's what you really is, Brad. Nolan Arenado. So last night was a serious dilemma, man. I watched the last four minutes of the All-Star game, Carlos Correa. I then watched Walking Dead real quick, and right when Walking Dead ended is when uh, the Kane Vasquez fight started, so the timing was phenomenal. And then it was for naught, because it ended in like 36 seconds with the lovely buckled knee. So much television on last night. Walking Dead, All-Star game, the fights... Number to 25, Wells, Mountcastle, and Cisco for the Orioles. So much, so much different viewing pleasure available. Walking Dead was horrible last night for anybody uh, keeping track at home. Douglas, I feel like he killed our case, man. Verdugo, Dodgers. AJ Pick. Yu Cheng Chang. What's the topic on what? Topic on what, Lothar? JB Buscasis. Oh, no, we were just uh, talking about how much uh, good television was on last night at, like, the same time. And by we, I mean me. AJ Pook, 125. that super duper quick and it'll break this second half it's either that or start taking off layers of clothes and I'm pretty sure I speak for everybody when we don't want that to happen That's the that's the thing, dude. It was so cold in here. I I like moved it the temperature the, uh, the thermostat way up. 
I should have went with the gradual. What's up, Big Sky? What's up, Jay Wood? What's up, Kevin? What's up, Luigi? What's up, Matt? What's up, Monty? What's up, Kent? Boys and girls, limited football next. And then we're going to get started on the prisms. And then uh, hopefully uh, pop out that uh, revolutionary war. It's going lovely. It's going lovely. Getting the Bowman uh, Brokeski. Man, I'll tell you what, I'm ready for summertime again, man. Dana and I had our first date night in two years last night. My parents came over, watched the girls, yada, yada, yada. The roads were a sheet of ice, man. But I, I was desperate to go see a movie, so we went anyway. We saw that new Liam Neeson movie. It's not bad. But I had to drive like 30 miles an hour all the way there. Sam, I'll tell you what, little fella, I'll be, I'll be Bobby. You can do that to me, but my hand is gonna catch it right after it bounces off and caroms off my head, and I'm skedaddling. No, that would not happen in Miami. It certainly wouldn't. There's a lot of places that that wouldn't happen, Shadow. Not just Miami. Jake, do on the eBay breaks this week. Give me, uh, give me a report card, Shadow. I was going to say, when I logged on today, I saw the uh, chat from Saturday, and I, I believe you called him Fake Bates. Matt, Matt, Matt. Come think of it, that's right, Shadow. You weren't in the chat on the uh, end there. So it was like the last like, 10 entries. <laughs> he calls me Fake Jake. Oh, yeah. Guys, get in that revolutionary war. Get in that sucker. Keep your box, win a case. 2017 Flawless Collegiate, where you can get my homies. Plus, we're going to start firing out those Prism 5 boxes. Limited football is up next, bro. But, as you know, that's like an eight-minute break. Speaking of that, let's look at the store real quick. Buddy, Revolutionary War is at 12. Wallace Collegiate's down to three, guys. Nice, Matt. First off the line. Yeah, all four prisons are definitely in striking distance. Nice, dude. 
I mean, obviously your answer is going to be completely biased for pulling a card of that nature, but uh, how select look? Is it delightful? Guys, there's only three left in that flawless collegiate hit random. If anybody wants to uh, cancel that sucker out, we can hurry up and bust that right after we do this uh, plates and patches. Or I mean this Bowman before we do plates and patches and then get started on the, uh, the, the, the trajectory towards filling the Revolutionary War along with the, uh, the prism. Everything we got tonight is pretty much a longer break, Young Craft. So, to be honest with you, I am beyond ecstatic that this Bowman filled up prior to live so that I could get the Bowman done. And I'm not penciling this hoss in at like midnight. True story, fam. What's up, Brian? Guys, just to give you all a uh, kind of a landscape of the week is what it's looking like is um, I'm obviously uh, breaking uh, today. Um, I don't believe I'm going to be live tomorrow. I will then be live um, all day on uh, Wednesday and probably the better part of Thursday uh, to rip through all of the uh, impeccable and select. What's up, Josh? I will then um, probably be off on Friday, uh, Saturday, uh, Sunday, and uh, possibly bumping uglies back on Monday. Uh, yeah, we got snow last night. Well, last night was freezing rain, and then a little bit of snow, and then it snowed hardcore today, and then we get snow again tomorrow, Shadow. Uh, Brian, I said that you can win a case of 2017 Flawless Collegiate Football. Two briefcases, a full sealed case in the Revolutionary War. Uh, well, Matt just said that uh, Select was pretty sweet. You know, take that for what it is worth. Matt is not a tout, Monty, uh, I, I'm sure as you know. So uh, I have high hopes. I have high hopes. In that Revolutionary War, you also get to keep your box. Ooh, you had a nice first off the line box as well. What'd you hit, Monty? Loaded's a good thing. Wow. Look at Joel spitballing some random bullshit. Holy hell, Monty. Good luck, fellas. <laughs> Jorge Mateo. What, uh, is the, is the JJ Wada like a one one Alright, this is a one-on-one, I'm such a dumbass. Like, is it a shield? 
Or is it just like a, a black finite uh, parallel, Monty? No, I mean, I believe it, Joel. It's kind of like uh, top baseball, top series one baseball, series two baseball and such. It's got massive followings. Black parallel. Hoskins, four ninety nine. Okay. Pretty excited then. A little uh little select sauce, a little uh little bit a little impeccable sauce. Should be a fun little Wednesday and Thursday. Alzole. Oh wow, that JJ Watt is beautiful, man. And that Sam I am is a tasty little treat. Okay. Very nice. Tasty. Are you serious, Joel? That's sick, man. Dennis Santana. Douglas, share some hits with everybody else. My goodness, man. My goodness. Nice, Matt. Wait a minute. Monty, you're telling me what you just showed is from one box? Is this, in fact, what you are telling me? Oh, my God. Sweet mother of God. Evan White Atomic. Lane in low. <laughs> Give me a fucking too. It's mighty nice of you, Joel. Mighty nice of you. Guys, Revolutionary War in the store. 12 spots left. Or you grab spots in the prison five box bangers and try to win your spot way in there. Uh, plates and patches up next, unless those last three flawless spots sell out, in which case we'll do that flawless real quick, because that will take all of about four minutes. Junior Fernandez. of amount of sorting for the BD Jizzle. Get that study on. Get that study on. Scott Kingery, Orange Refractor to 25 for the Phillies. Spencer Howard. Come on, let's see something else fancy to go along with that beaters. Pedro Avila. Necessarily what we were looking for there, but congratulations to the Padres. Domingo Acevedo, Atomic.
I will just put the other two in the closet for now at the Barkley Arcade. Uh, they'll show up in there. <laughs> if they do not show up. Barkley's so good, man. He's so fun to watch. He's like Barry Sanders-like. Nick Gordon for the Twins. Really? A little lawsuit sauce, huh? <sighs> Who's be? I feel like, unfortunately, you may uh, be correct in that um, assessment. Here's the turning it around from here forth, Hoosby. Get you some of that Hoosby love. Dude's got a nice stash. You hit an Isaac Bongo 101 checkerboard auto the other day from a blaster? Dude, I want that. I'm seriously contemplating being an Isaac Bonga super collector. I'm totally joking. I do not want your Bonga. <laughs> Joe Joe Romero to 150 for the Phillies. Uh, Lothar, it's it, it, it's it's a work in progress, my man. I do also have a now a diagnosed herniated disc, so I got to get the injection in my back, and I got to get physical therapy so that I can hopefully get rid of like you know all the pain from that as well, Lothar. It can still be mine. Oh, I'm good. Ian Anderson. That bonga belongs with you. Carlos Correa to 150. Nice, Lothar. Never stopped. Don't tell me that. I'm literally contemplating moving because I'm not going to be able to like live at my house. I'm not going to be able to do firewood and stuff. Whatever that is, Lothar, that just doesn't sound lovely. Code 45, 260. Listen here, Lothar. Don't you be putting negative thoughts in my head. Pedro Avila. <laughs> I look so eagle. What's up, Jim? Mike Soroka, number 50. Dude, Joel, I said something to Dana the other day. I said, Dana, you want to you move to Texas? And she's like, Texas? I'm like, why not? She's like, um, I don't know. Drinking hell. I can't drink, dude. I'm on blood thinners. I'm a total shit show right now, Lothar. I'm hoping to completely be completely out of shit show status within the next three to six months. Domingo Acevedo. Dude, I honestly, I want to go to Texas. I would like to go to Dallas. I'd like to go to San Antonio. Uh, you tell me Austin is lovely. I would, I would like to actually like tour Texas. It's like one of the one states I've never been. Uh, December 12th, Lothar, is, uh, the, the, is the date that I have uh, diagnosed it. That's when my toes started tingling. Jose Trevino. Uh, Butterfield, that's uh, what I have uh, been doing a little bit.
<laughs> I know. Dane is so kinky, though, Matt. She's just like, you know what? Let's try this position. Let's, uh, let's, let's try this. You want to do the upwards, downwards, reverse hoochie mama doggy? I'm like, I guess. I'm going to give it a try. You want to do the sex pretzel? I guess. Whatever. Purple, Edward Olivares. What's up, Paul? <laughs> Austin is amazing. San Antonio has some cool areas like Riverwalk, Dallas, and Houston are meh. Fair assessment. Cold 45, two six seven, better than four to me. Paul, let's uh, let's be honest with ourselves here. You could put in any day of the week at the end of that sentence, and I think it plays, my friend. <whistles> Forrest Whitley to twenty-five. Oh, guys, let's play. Uh, Let's play everybody share your opinion. Stop it, Lothar. So, um, Cedric Mullins for the Orioles. Here's the shakedown. Here's the shakedown. Let's say in a hypothetical situation, you were getting married, right? Let's say um, you decide to make it an adults-only reception. Let's say one of your brothers and his wife are like, not a problem. We're we're gonna we're gonna get a babysitter uh, for our, our baby anyway. And then you had another brother, who uh, him and his wife say, well, we want our kids there. And then say, well, we're gonna go to the wedding, but we're not coming to the reception, mind you. Both of which are in the wedding party. How does one react to that? How does one react to that? Bobby Bradley to 150. To each their own. I'm just I want to see what everybody else's reaction is and I'll, and I'll share what my opinion is. DJ Stewart. Number to 50, Mitch Keller. <laughs> right, Lothar. As long as they leave a card with money, it's all good. <laughs> this is how I look at it, okay? This is how I look at it. Me, personally... Well, no, the, their thought process is is they want everybody to just unwind. They don't want their or his parents to have to watch everybody's kids and whatnot. Because they, they enjoy um, having uh, some bevies. And Dana and I's wedding, kids and everything were there too. It was a blast. I got ripped. With that said, it's his one day to get married. Of course, it's a hypothetical situation. If he does not want kids there, let their grandparents babysit them for three hours. What is three hours to avoid drama and a headache? It's not like you've not left your kids prior to this event. I would say, my opinion is, is honor the kid's request for the wedding. It's his day to get married. 150, Bo Bichette. If that's what he wants, that's what he wants. It's not a slight to the kids. It's not saying, I hate your kids. We're going to be getting a babysitter for our kids. The Ronald. Corbin 
Raiders. Oh, they are. They're absolutely hilarious. Mitch Kelly to 125. Dana was a little bit sad about it just because she wanted CeCe to bust a move on the dance floor because CeCe loves dancing. But there'll, there'll be other weddings for her to bust a move at. Man, what's going on with that Butterfield? You should probably buy them all. But every one Butterfield, and then you could raise it to $79.99. Yo, I'm Magata. $4.99. Flex on them, Butterfield. Flex on them. Carlos Correa. Mitchell White Atomic. Man, we uh, we started off on fire with that Peters and Jimenez. Hillard. Douglas didn't give us a chance to rebound. He came out guns blazing right out of the rip. <laughs> right? Peters all case long is uh, is tough to uh, to rebound from. All right, so recap. We got the Peters red, the Ronald, Bo Bichette to one fifty, Mitch Keller to fifty, Bobby Bradley, Cedric Mullins, Forrest Whitley, Oliveres, Soraka, Carlos Correa, JoJo. Nick Gordon, Avila, Kenry, Santana, Hoskins, Jimenez, Elzale, Burns, Allen, Verdugo, the Orioles, Walker Bueller, Garrett Cooper, Cole Raggins, and Hoskins to 150. Fellas, thank you all for joining. Very much appreciate it, guys.